Okay, now let's retrieve items from the array. Print on the console the first element of the array. So we said last time that to retrieve an item, it's the opposite of to set an item or the other way around, vice versa. So this is the position zero. This is the position one. That's a good exercise that you can do at the beginning as long as you're not familiar with, with the concept of position versus item. Remember the position? It's only the number that represents the position in the array. 8, 9, 10, and so it goes, right? So it's telling us to print the con in the console the first element on the array. So to retrieve an element from an array, you do, let's put it on a variable for a second, aux. And we're going to have r, because that's the name of the array, and then square brackets. That's how you retrieve. And it's telling us that they want the Print on the console, the first element of the array. So the first element will be the position zero, right? Because it's the first element, but it's in the position zero because the zero is the first position. And then I console.log out. You can also do it all in one line like this. You can just do console.log r in the position zero and it will be the same thing. Okay, so then print on the console the fourth element of the array. Okay, so the fourth one. So I guess I'll do the same thing, but this this time I'll do it just straightforward. You know, R in the position, the fourth element, so the third one, right? I guess that's okay, that's enough. Let's try it, let's see, let's test it. Amazing, 